have the younger brother here finally. Yeah, I was very happy for him. Um, he was over the moon last night. He, he was actually the first one to look. We was, all, we was actually all like just head down and everything. He's, he's like, oh, look, look, turn around and all this. So, no, nah, I, was, I was very happy for him and, you know, very happy for our whole family. So. Any, any nerves that you might go to another club? Oh, I, I don't, maybe there was a little bit like Melbourne or like not Melbourne, but like interstate anyway. And um, but I thought I sort of had confidence within the Lions to place a bit on him, and which they did, which is good. What advice have you given him ahead of the, the season? Um, you know, it's, it's going to take a lot of hard work. I know preseason is is not the easiest thing, but I was saying at the, at the end of the day, when you make your first game, if, if that is next year, or a couple of years, it's very rewarding. So. Um, yeah, just keep, keep your head down and work hard, yeah. Excuse my ignorance here, Kenny, but how much footy have you guys played together? Um, probably last time was probably under-12s, um, but I'd say probably like seven games at least. That was between under-10s and under-12s, so, yeah. Must be an exciting prospect to think that you're going to hopefully get the chance next year or in the future. Yeah, even if it's at um, the new VFL level or um, hopefully AFL a couple of years or next year, but... Yeah, it'll be exciting times for us and the family together. Jared was saying how this year playing with Tom was the highlight of his like you know career. You know, yeah. which you know, would you agree? Yeah, I, I actually can't wait. It's gonna yeah. be good because um, we, I, th I think we know each other's game styles and the way we both played growing up with each other. So um, yeah, next year's gonna be real fun for, for us too, and can't can't wait. Like, how did, how did it feel last night, mate, when you knew you'd be joining? Yeah, um, I was just over the moon. It was so exciting. Um, you know, just a proud moment for me and Kadeen and the whole family. What was your, your mum, I think, said the other day, your mum would be keenly watching from back home? Yeah, and she... I imagine you spoken to her? Yeah, uh, she was on, on the phone call to her then, um, straight after. The whole family was there, actually, where she was, and um, they were all, all um, just over the moon and um, trying, to, trying to speak to her, and I could, the whole family was just yelling. And, uh, it, was, it was good, though. It was um, a good moment. Like Kitty had a rapid rise again last season, had some fantastic moments, played some finals footy. Yeah. Were you watching on and sort of drawing inspiration from it? Yeah, definitely. I was definitely watching um, every game that um, he played. I was, you know, I was watching all either there. If it was a home game, um, yeah. So um, you know, he's had a bit of big impact on me. I look up to him, and um, you know, I want to be at that level that he got to. You afforded yourself a chance to dream of, of actually tasting that sort of high level footy. Yeah, for sure. Um, something I've always um, dreamt of when I was a little kid. Um, or something always I want to do. Are there any other players, I mean, other than your brother, that you look up to? Oh, uh, yeah, you know, I, I guess, um, you know, there's a lot of players that um, uh, I like to watch, yeah. But, like, yeah, um, he's probably definitely the one, one of the, um, he's definitely up there with the one I look up to. What can fans look forward to, Kitty, um, with your brother? Like, what sort of traits and what do you like about his... his yeah, he's, he's pretty classy for, for his, um, his size. Um, he can jump, he can take pack marks, so he can do that better than me, so look forward to that. If he sees it, he'll go for it and he can definitely take a screamer, so. The Lions have really become a family club, obviously we've seen with the Berry boys and, and obviously now your brother here. Is that something you're grateful for, playing for a club that's so family oriented? Yeah, it's, it's a great club, Brisbane Lions. Um, I think even in the past they had a fair few brothers come through, so um, no, it's a great club and I'm very fortunate that that they chose him last night and like I said can't wait to get stuck in. What about one for the academy Blake? Like you're obviously both you come through that academy and yeah. there's a ton of players on the list now that have done that. Like what what has the uh, academy done for your progression? Oh, you know they've just I'm just I guess I'm grateful for what they've done for me, um giving me the opportunity um, starting a couple of years ago, um, playing playing a lot of games um against um quality teams, you know which um, I, I think I've got look, looked at through them um, and just, yeah, just give me an opportunity and I think I've made the most of it. Come back in January, is that right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, right. yeah what are the plans for, uh, what's that, Christmas? What's um, I think we'll, we'll head back up north. Yeah, Christmas Eve. For, Christmas Eve, uh, we'll go for a week. Yeah, uh, see mum for a couple of weeks again, all the other um, family members and then we'll come back January 3rd or whatnot. So yeah. Yeah. We'll probably spend a week and so just go and swim, swim holes and stuff like that, so yeah. can't wait, yeah. Spend you guys, um, uh, um, what's name, share a house here as well? Yeah, well, I'm living out with my partner at the moment, yeah. so um, in the New Year's we'll be looking to, to find a place and then hopefully if, if he wants to, he can move in or, because he doesn't live far from here, he lives in Widow Manly, so um, 
whether he chooses to move out or not, he can, he can always stay home there. Is there always footy, footy talk, you know, when he speaks all the time? Sorry? Uh, like, is there always like footy talk between you when he, you know, when he speaks all the time? Yeah. 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 Oh, I guess we just, um, you know, we just, we've always been around each other, so uh, we're just comfortable with whatever we talk about. So, yeah. But yeah, we, um, we know that, um, we know that um, we're footy, you know, we, we love it, and um, yeah. We talk about it, but not 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 often. It's just more yeah. Yeah, family and yeah, yeah. all this other stuff. But I guess when it, when, it, when the footy's on, we, we talk about footy and you know all the other stuff. So yeah. if you uh, do end up living together, what does the dynamic be like? Kitty is the older brother. Will you force Blake to do all the chores, or are you are you happy to share? Or <laughs> no, nah, it's actually funny. I'm still learning how to cook, so <laughs> <laughs> um, we'll have to bounce off each other and you know just I guess teach each other. So yeah, but if he does end up moving else. I guess we just learn, learn, learn with each other. Yeah. Like, how's he go? Is it cool for you to be getting taken oh, out of it? No, I don't see him cook much. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. He might, might be alright. See what happens.